Okay, so more coins. Always a bonus. And the fire escape key should take us somewhere new. And I'm about to get attacked. Now it's unlocked. <laughs> okay, let's check this room out. Evils. Evils everywhere. Here to kill me. He's going to attack Harry Mason. You better come correct. See? <laughs> That was just wrong. Take that. Take that. Take that. Kick it. What's my life like now? Oh God. Uh, I wonder what my 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 life is like. But I'm not gonna find out by using a map. Ooh, it's going to a red tinge. Let's have a drink. Mmm. in the kitchen? Nope. That door's well and truly blocked up. That door's well and truly blocked up. We've got some handgun bullets. I wonder how many handgun bullets I've got now. 10 in there. 70. Get in there. <laughs> Getting to the number that I'd consider. Ooh, a sightseeing brochure for the town. He's lying here. Good drink. Welcome to Silent Hill. Silent Hill is a quiet little lakeside resort town. We're happy to have you. Take some time out of your busy schedules and enjoy a nice restful vacation here. Row after row of quaint old houses, a gorgeous mountain landscape and a lake which shows different sides of its beauty with the passing of the day. From sunrise to late afternoons to sunset. Silent Hill will move you and fill you with a feeling of deep peace. <laughs> I, hope you, I hope your time here will be pleasant and your memories will last forever. In the sorry, thank or credit to Roger Will Dark. I'm not reading it again. Massive credit to the uh, to that beautiful thing there. I think staying with you forever and post traumatic stress. <laughs> Quite close. Uh, right, so that's unlocked now, leading me back into the the main dude lab. We saw that 102 was blocked. James used his initiative on that score. It's like this is it. I gave him too much time. Let's ignore him. They're blocking the corridor. There's only one thing for it, folks. Let's cycle all the way through our menu to get the gun. Begin! Boo, it squiggled off. Where is he? Oh, for God's sake. The gun, as you can see, adds a brand new era of problems. <laughs> for me, especially. Let's check this door. Well, it truly blocked up. Life's in red, thanks to that asshole. You're not squiggling into me, it's not happening. It's just not happening. Okay, so there's no way there. Oh, was there another way to this corridor? Oh yeah, 101. 101? Will we ever be allowed out? <gasps> Maybe not. We're allowed in though. Oh, goodness. Oh, wow. Ooh. Let's ignore vomiting. Oh. Oh, God. What the? Who could have done this? I don't know. I am, however, going to uh, reload that and equip my stick. What's happening, dude? Nice socks. Shorts and socks. Just sexy. It wasn't me. I didn't do it. Do what? I didn't do anything. I, I swear. It 
was like this when I got here. My, uh, my name's James. <clears throat> James Sunderland. Um, Eddie. <clears throat> Eddie. <clears throat> Who's that dead guy in the kitchen? I didn't do it. I swear I didn't kill anybody. <clears throat> You're not friends with that red pyramid. <clears throat> Red pyramid thing. I don't know what you're talking about. Honest. But I did see some weird looking monsters. They scared the hell out of me. So I ran in here. Well, I guess this place isn't too safe either. What happened here anyway? Uh I I told you, I don't know. I'm not even from this town. I just I just... You too, huh? Something just brought you here, right? Yeah, you could say that. Well, whatever it is, I think you better get out of here soon. Yeah, you're right. What about you? I'll leave as soon as I'm done here. Eddie, be careful. James, I... I, um... You be careful, too. Oh, well. <clears throat> First impressions count. And Eddie... seems to enjoy vomiting as his pastime. I respect that. I respect that totally. Okay then, with the first floor cleared, we should be proud of ourselves. Because uh, I do believe that's all of the floors cleared. Except it wouldn't mark off 103. Or did I not? I'm sure that I, I actually checked it. I just think he was just like, bricked off. Me and you've got a fucking score to settle. Do you know that? Providing you was the same, don't squiggle away. Right, now is it marked off? I only mark it off for my own sanity's sake, and it's not an OCD thing, but it is a little. But I mean, I'll look back later and I'll, I'll think, where did I not go? Did I miss something? Where's that key? Where's that puzzle piece? Where's that? And it usually leads to me going back to rooms that were totally bricked up. I'm thinking, oh yeah, maybe it was that room. It wasn't that room. Anyways, with all this place cleared, I could say challenge complete. Let us jog up the stairs. Uh, yeah, second floor. We're going to go through the fire escape. Because unlike normal fire escapes, this fire escape doesn't just take us to the ground. Let's go and have a look. Oh wow, I remember this game so much better than I remember remembering it. <laughs> Sorry, I was having a drink while it was reading. I figured you could read it, if not. But anyways. We've had enough of Woodside and it's two-star accommodation. Let's go to this new place. Only I don't know what it's called. I do, really. It's called Blue Creek. But you don't know that. Not until I find the map. And you say, wow, it's called Blue Creek. And I say, yeah. And you say, Craig, you're talking to yourself. And I say, shut up. What a, a, so far, I like the decor. The vibe. It's nice. I like the toilet. It looks like there's something stuck inside the toilet. Will you take it out? What do you mean with the stick? Maybe a plunger? Or a glove? Oh, get your hand in there. Get your hand right in there and see what you pull out. Boof! What you found? What you found? A wallet? There's some kind of memo in it. Okay. Nine right, five left. Nine right. Hang on, no, wait a minute. Right on. 9, right, 5, left, 9, right, 10. I'm not going to remember that. 
Okay, that was awesome. No, 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 this way. There we go. Hello? You know your deco is a lot like the hotel next door. I mean, on a competitive level, you really should try and do something different. A safe! A safe. Okay, so it was... Is it nine... Nine... Five... Nine... Ten? Oh, he remembers it! What's in here then? Handgun bullets. Handgun bullets. Handgun bullets. Handgun bullets. What an awesome safe. What does that do for my handgun bullet count? I don't have a map. I didn't need to. Don't just throw a random map. You're not though that Rosewater Park was underlined. That's the significant place that James is trying to. 112 of 10 in the kit. So 122 bullets will be flying. <gasps> health drink. Thank you, health drink. I might chug one of those just for a you know, good measure. Where the fruit do I get a map for this place from? Because I remember being here before and I don't actually remember picking the I've gone through this whole place before and not picked the map up. And I don't do well if I don't pick a map up. It sends me a bit do lally in the brain, see? You fiend. Yeah. 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 I have no idea what's going on. He got back up. What the hell? James, kick him. Thank you. Neom. So we can see the rest of the corridor. Locked. 202 is locked. What was that? Oh, it's just a bit of spray paint. Locked. Ooh, not locked. Let's go down the floor. Because I figured if you're going to find a map, it might just be... In the main area, in the reception, right? That makes sense to anyone else? Oh, hang on. My spidey sense just tingled. There it is. <laughs> yeah, Blue Creek Apartments. Okay, so now we have a map of the area, we can start being more methodical. Do we start on the first floor? Look at that, it even marks off what we've already done. Or do we finish the second floor? <sighs> decisions, decisions. Let's, uh,. Let's go down to the first floor. Can we? Can we do that? I'm unsure. But it's worth looking. We can. Let's have a nosy around the first floor of Blue Creek Apartments. We'll probably get into a fight. Oh, that pathetic squeak is usually a, um, a bug. But if you step near him, he will bite you. <laughs> He'll bite your ankles. Black and bows. See? Asshole bug. Mannequin. Not until that bug's gone. Mannequin. 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 What is with me in games with mannequins at the moment? I have an exceptional height of mannequins. Oh, you was guarding a door that wasn't even locked. Well, near to you. Yeah, but the bugs actually do bite your ankles. They hurt you. They bite your tootsies. Five, and then the one over the way. Oh, no, he's coming back. He's coming back. Where is he? Let's get him. He warranted that noise. Medical kid. He warranted that horrible noise. Wow, wow. It was the approach of bug. Oh. <gasps> A door. A door. As soon as it goes, it fades to black. You are immediately filled with this trepidation. You're just like, uh oh. Hello, kitchen. I can seem to have a better view of the kitchen in here for some reason. And you can't always trust it neither because there could be a mannequin in here. It's just not moving. There's nothing in the bookshelf that looks like it would be of any use. What about in this? What? There's something written on the desk. Three bright coins in five holes B. At one end sits the seducer of she. The wind from behind, the woman doth play. The formless one, nor lies furthest from there. The old one beside, the serpent sits not. Tis to the prisoner's left that he doth rot. 
Ah, oh, so we're going to be putting our coins in here. Okay. But we don't have all of them yet, as you as you heard from what it, what was what it was you know what I mean, what was said. Oh, a save point as well. Hey, very convenient. Locked. Right, I'm going to pull a save. <clears throat> Create a new save file. No, I haven't entered the data on my 360. So. Right then, I think that'll do for today. I hate to leave the game, but I've got other stuff to do. Um, <clears throat> so, when you join me, we will explore more of Blue Creek Apartments. So, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, favorite. Give us a click. It, take, you know, it takes a second and it means a lot to me. Um, I will see you next time. Take care, everyone.